Welcome back to another TCBM slash BCBM. This is actually the first video that I've made in several weeks. Uh, all the videos that have been uploaded recently ha were, were pre-made, I guess I should say, before I went on a pretty long uh, two-week vacation, uh, family vacation. So now I'm back and going to get back into the, uh, the swing of making videos. I'm not going to be, if you've been keeping up on the cat's meowth, you'll see that the big booster opening has ended and I'm just kind of uploading um, some different types of videos just every few days or so so uh, really uh, just things are there's so much going on right now I uh, just can't keep up with daily videos and of course without um, so many boosters to open up I don't have the material for daily videos but I'm hoping to just uh, buy uh, you know two to three day uploads be able to have enough stuff to keep you guys coming back for more so I'm going to show three BCBMs and one TCBM in this video. The I'll go ahead and do the TCBMs first since they're the least exciting as far as uh, videos to watch. First off, we have a sale from Jordy Man. Quick note, thanks for selling me these cards, Jordy Man, and got the money safe and sound. Next one is from Mr. DJ BG, or I'm sorry, Mr. DJ BJ. And says, uh, Dear the Cat's Meowth, here's the 23 for the Venusaur Legendary Collection and Charizard Base Set 2. I'm 25 and just got back into Pokemon cards a couple of months ago. I'm only collecting black and white sets now, but I couldn't resist the Venusaur, the, the, well, the Venu, uh, Venusaur and Charizard cards because I never had them as a kid. Hopefully we can do business in the future if this goes well, Mr. DJ BG, uh, or BJ. Hopefully you'll be, uh, I've, I've Actually, everything I'm showing here, I've already sent out most of um, most of what you're seeing. So hopefully you'll be getting my card soon if you haven't already. And uh, if you're collecting black and white sets now, uh, maybe check out some of my other videos uh, coming up um, pretty soon. Dragons Exalted is uh, the first pre-release is this week uh, or this weekend. I haven't quite decided if I'm going to be uploading Trade Binder updates on this channel or I'm going to do them on the Cat's Meowth, and simply considering the Cat's Meowth because I, um, I've been, well, my hard drive, uh, unless we can recover some stuff, pretty much fried, and uh, that was another lovely thing I returned to on my way back on when I got back from vacation was a computer that did not work. And uh, on that hard drive were all of the original videos, um, all the big booster openings, so I wasn't able to do a recap. Um, like I said, maybe in uh, I can I, I've got someone coming out in the next few weeks, hopefully to to see if anything can re be recovered. If so, I may do another recap. If not, I may just do trade binder updates on the cat's meowth. So anyone that's watching this video, if you're subscribed to Computer Three NCSU, you definitely need to be subscribed to the cat's meowth as well. Much better stuff on that channel. Um, you'll have a much better time, and uh, I mean, say sub to this one too. Lots of um, cool trades. I'm sure that'll be coming in uh, with the dragons exalted set and you'll definitely want to check those out so um yeah there's that second sale pretty cool to see another uh person my age getting back into pokemon uh for all of you older folks out there it just shows that uh being old and playing pokemon is nothing to be ashamed of so uh really glad to see another another older fellow uh getting back into the game the next sale is from Melcero23, and note says, Dear the Cat's Meowth, thanks again for helping me with my EV Evolution collection. As, o uh, as always, whenever you have them, I'm willing to get them from you. Your friend, Melcero23, and I think this is the third, maybe fourth, uh, sale that we've worked out. So, very, very trusted seller, um, gets the money to you pretty quick, and uh, very reasonable prices as well. Um, and I say reasonable prices because um, he's very good about just making um, reasonable offers. And um, pretty much if someone makes me a reasonable offer, I'm more than happy to take it. it. saves me the trouble of trying to look up prices on eBay and trolling toad and trying to figure out a fair price. If it's something that I already like, hey, I'll go for it. So uh, save probably what is uh, best for last, considering that it's the only trade. And so it's the only Pokemon card you'll actually see in this video. This is from Sir Samston, and note says, Catherine, once again, thanks for the trade. I'm glad that I could trade away one of my many duplicates for something useful. I seem to be good at pulling EXs as long as they're Groudon. Look forward to future trades. If you ever need two more Groudon, you know who to call. Sam. And this is Sir Samston, and we traded for a full art Groudon EX. So right now, um, 
we're in a, well, beginning of a new season. It's coming up. Uh, I mean, Worlds hasn't taken place yet, but for most of us, uh, we, you know, we're not going to Hawaii to participate in Worlds. So we're starting to think about uh, the, the next season, black and white cards on. And um, yeah, so I, I, I have a, well, for the last season, I pretty much collected play sets of all the ultra rares, all the primes, so that whatever deck um, I never I came up with or that I felt was good, you know, someone else came up with it, I would be able to play it. I haven't quite been doing that with the new set. I've, I've got some extras uh, outside of my collection, but I just really haven't been uh, worried too much about a full play set. I'm going to try and start judging uh, some tournaments in, uh, uh, during this season, so kind of looking forward to trying out something new. Which means I'll be playing a little bit less, but uh, I will still be getting tournament reports out there every now and then. But right now, the only EXs I'm really trading for are just kind of um, any new EXs for like bulk things, like hollows, rares, revs. You know, stuff to lighten up my binders. So um, that's just kind of where I'm at right now. If anyone had any EXs available for trade, that's pretty much just what I'm offering for them. Um, a lot of people just want to do ultra rares for other ultra rares, but since I'm really not in an, in any need of anything right now, um, that's just how I'm going to do it and just try and clear out some other stuff. So, um, yeah, you can tell it's my first video for a while because I rambled on quite a bit. So uh, definitely stay tuned. In the next few days, I'll have some other videos up. Uh, I've got another TCBM here and a few more BCBMs, and I've also got some FCBMs that I'll be uh, posting up shortly. So definitely stay tuned, and as always, thanks for watching.